Breeze. Welcome back to another beautiful day in Hana, here in Antigua. The wind's a little bit light today, but it's perfect kite foiling weather. So we need a couple other kite foilers. We're gonna make our way upwind to some flat water and hopefully have a cool little foil explorer. Let's go, Breeze. Woo! Three, five, go! Coming from the wild, wild west indeed. Yeah, we got Jamie heading out. I'm gonna go on a 12 meter reach and a new uh, sonar north foil with a big old front wing which is super duper handy when the wind's light got the 1150 Ew. let's go booze Ew. thanks so much girl see you soon have fun Ew. <laughs> there we go new baby let's test her out Session's on. Light breeze, probably like 12 knots today. So good, like 17 meter twin tip, but absolutely perfect boiling weather. So let's go to Rome. First Rome of 2021, booze. Woo! Got the whole crew out, Jamie, Jack, a couple other peeps. So let's do this, Ruse. Let's go on our own. Alrighty, Bruce. So yeah, we are out. And we don't really have too much of a plan today. We're just gonna roam around, try and find some flat water. Uh, Jack and Jamie is our first kind of big explorer, so we're gonna kind of show them around. Go to the classic spots and yeah, take you guys along for the trip. So, we are en route or en route in transit. We're in transit. <laughs> Alrighty, Bruce, so we are about halfway to Maiden Island. If you guys saw my last video, Maiden Island has a special place in both mine and Megan's heart forever because that's where Megan kind of became my fiance. So, that's pretty sick. So we may hang out there for a little bit or we may just keep going, go further up to another pretty sick flat water spot. It's probably twice as far away, but yeah, because these guys have already seen Maiden Island, but uh, once we get there, we'll decide and if we hang out, shoot a little bit or just keep it moving, booze, go upwind because the sun's setting. So uh, it's all good now, but on the way back, it's going to be pretty hard to see, see where we're going because we're going to be blinded by the sun. But yeah, Bruce, freaking great to be out. Bring on 2021, Bruce. Let's go. Woo! And yeah, this is one of my favorite spots to come foiling at. Because it's, it's a bit of a mitch, but it's not too, too far away from Java. So it's pretty easy to foil up to. And always pretty quiet. One boat with a doggy on board there, but always pretty quiet. Winds always pretty decent. And the water's buttery flat. Yeah, made it, Bruce. Made it. Ooh. There's Jack coming in. Gonna want to go on. Yeah, I took for rocks right here. Yeah. yeah, bud. We made it. So yeah, we're just deciding. We can either hang here for a bit, or we just keep going. Up to you. Watch out for Jack's kite, Jesus Christ. Ah, oh, uh, cool, well let's just keep going then, so. Alrighty, so crew's decided, we're just gonna go all the way up to flat water spot number two, which is kind of a secret spot. You guys probably know it if you've been watching for a while, but yeah, we're just gonna go way up, way up. That's if Jamie doesn't crash his kite. <laughs> yeah, all right. See you guys up there. More upwind in to go. Okay, let the down, let the upwind mission continue, booze. Checked out Maiden Island, it's cool, but we might as well go further. Everyone's got time today, no teaching, no lessons, got the day off, so we're gonna go Rome, booze, Rome City. Yeah, 
series to coming up to the magical point. Right here is where we did the whole proposal shenanigans. Check it out. The spot's gonna be special to me forever, man. Right here. Woo! That spot, not too long ago, Megan's like, yes, I'll be stuck with you forever. <laughs> Like we've hit a little wind shadow from that big island back there, but we're almost there, Briz. We are almost there. Still got a hour and a bit of sunlight, so yeah, we'll probably get up there, roam around in the Fizzat for a bit, and then make our way back while we still got some light. But yeah, there we go, Briz. We're almost there. Woo. So now we're getting super close to this bazaar, but now we're also pretty much in the reef minefield. So we can still kind of see now, but definitely got to be kind of careful around here. There's a lot of reef, a lot of reef. Oh yeah. There you go, reef, 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 reef. And then it's really hard to see this way. Yeah, we just made it through a sea minefield of reef. Hopefully those boys make it through without hitting. Yeah, we here, booze, we here. Scope it out! Like everyone's here, no one ran aground, so pretty friggin' sick. Woo! It gets shallow. Smooth operator. <laughs> well done, dude. Oh, that's sick. Oh. Coral heads there, <laughs> yeah, like mental, mental reef all through there. Yeah, dude. But this is it. This is the spot. There we go. So how many kite instructors does it take to securely put a kite down and keep it there? Oh yeah. Oh 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 oh. Let's not get tangled. What do you think? You think it's gonna be there when you come back, Jack? Today. I think so. <laughs> <laughs> Look at these guys. Came prepared. Chocolate biscuits. Camera gear. Because it'd be a nice place to have like you could get bring your chicken swarmer out here. <laughs> <laughs> Cut all the way up here. Yeah. <laughs> Just for lunch. <laughs> yeah. Seventeen point four four kilometers. Yeah. Well done, Jamie. You're the master dude. You you bring the biscuits. Mm. You track how long it takes. You're about to fire the drone. Yeah. You're like the MV MVP today, dude. For sure. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, Bruce, so we made it. Uh, James is going to probably fire the drone for a little bit. We'll roam around, hopefully get a couple more shots. And then, yeah, make our way back before we're riding in the dark. <laughs>
Hey, Eddie Booz. Kate's still here. Kate's still there. Jack's still got his Kate. Last week we had a pretty succession. Hope we got some sick shots. Now we gotta make it back home before the sun's gone. You can see it's nearly set. So, let's mission it, Booz. Go time to get back home. <laughs> So just making our way back. The sun's about to set. Uh, but yeah, big thanks for tuning in. This was a super fun adventure with the boys. Kind of showing them a new spot, having an epic session at the same time. Uh, so yeah, big thanks for tuning in. Hopefully you guys enjoyed the video. If you guys missed it, uh, me and Megan just started our own kite school called Kelsey Kiteboarding. You can check us out at kelsekiteboarding.com or just in the description down below. Coming out in Tantiga, want to learn how to shred, or you want to go and, ex go and explore some six spots, hit us up. We'll gladly show you guys around and make sure you have a sick time while you're in Antigua. But yeah, was a big thanks for tuning in. Stoked to be back out shredding and making vids. And uh, yeah, I'll see you guys soon in another video. Peace, love, and big up. Woo!